In Wilcox County, investigators have arrested and charged the mayor of Pineview. 34-year-old Brandon Holt faces 75 counts of theft by taking. According to the Wilcox County Sheriff's Office, Brandon Holt spent three hours in the Wilcox County Jail before bonding out on Monday, January 6th. 16th, I'm sorry. Holt was arrested for 75 counts of theft by taking. The mugshot on your screen now isn't his most previous mugshot, but it's from 2022 when he was arrested another time on theft charges in Bibb County, according to WMAZ in Macon. The case file has been given to the core deal district attorney Brad Rigby. We're still working to see how much money Holt is accused of stealing and what consequences he'll face. I reached out to the city of Pineview for comment on these allegations and they declined as this investigation is ongoing. Joining us tonight, new information on a story we first reported Monday. Warren Chill Pineview Mayor Brandon Holt took nearly $65,000 from the city using a payment app. Those warrants say he did it over 75 different transactions for a few months. I spoke with dozens of people here in Pineview. A few of them have actually met Mayor Brandon Holt and they say he's a pretty nice guy. But the one thing people kept telling me is they're hoping this isn't true because $65,000 is a lot to bear for a town of only 450. He's always done right by me. He's never done any wrong. He doesn't seem like he's a conniving, evil, greedy person at all. Stephen Booker says he'd know because he works for the city of Pineview. He doesn't believe the accusations. I don't see them to be true. You know, it's like, think about it. Why would you get in this position to to take something away from the hard working people of this city. According to Holt's arrest warrant, he took the money through 75 different cash app transactions between June 26th and October 11th. The money went from the city's general account to Holt's own account. Shane Leverett says a lot of people in town are talking about it. Well, you know, in a small town, you hear everything. I mean, we've heard we've heard, you know, $120,000, $140,000, you know, and, you know, so I mean, it's just you know, he deserves a day in court just like everybody else. Leverett says he doesn't know what to think, but he does worry about Holtz and the town's safety. According to Holtz's Facebook page, he was the victim of an August drive-by shooting in LaGrange. What if somebody strikes again and, you know, somebody's caught in a crossfire? Now, we do know Holt is out on bond, so I stopped by City Hall earlier to try and meet with him and see what he had to say about all of this, but they told me he wasn't in the office. So now, to put this in perspective, $65,000 comes out to about $143 for each Pineview resident, and this isn't the first time Holt has been in legal trouble. Right now, he is awaiting trial in Bibb County for nine counts of identity fraud. His indictment claims he stole more than $22,000 from Macon Asphalt starting back in 2018. I think that all government is a waste of taxpayer money.